national TV show is in Montgomery and it will be here all week. You may remember several weeks ago we invited you to nominate people who needed a room in their home renovated. Well now Antonio Sabato Jr. and the Fix It and Finish It team are working in the area over five houses this next week. WSFA 12 News reporter Bethany Davis joins us live now from a location in Montgomery where this first project is well underway. Bethany fill us in. We saw you a little bit earlier. Now you're inside that house. Yeah, well, Melissa, it's a little cooler in here, and uh, and it's really cool to show you also some of the work that's being done. And I want to I want to show you though uh, we are doing a lot of renovating here. We are also in TV production. So what you're watching now is the contractor and the decorator actually shooting a scene for the show, fix it and finish it. The decorator's name is Nikki Huggins, and you've been studying these uh, these applicants and the homeowners. Talk to me a little bit about how you come up with a plan to do the decoration. Well, uh, obviously we meet with the homeowners and uh, that's actually our most favorite part of the entire experience meeting the homeowners and then you know we we are really observant we take a look at what they already have in their homes and they tell us you know what they want and and they tell us all kinds of things you know what their favorite colors are for what they like to do and then we take all that information and put it together and create a design plan for them that meets their needs but also gives them the visual eye candy that they want, that they're going for. So how far in advance do you have to plan for something like this? Oh, if we have three weeks, we're lucky. <laughs> three weeks is, is about it these days. Okay, well that's a lot to get done in a short amount of time. And in this case, we're working on two rooms, the living room and the dining room. Talk to me a little bit about how your plans for this came together. Well, I, uh, I saw the homeowner's painting, which I think, I don't, I don't know if you've seen that yet, and the minute I walked in the front door and saw that painting, I knew that we were going to connect. And this, these particular homeowners are very edgy, urban, they're more like Brooklynites or Los Angeles couple, and uh, I knew right away what, I, I absolutely knew right away what to do for them. So um, then I, Chris, the homeowner said, oh, I don't want white walls, that's the only thing I have to say, I just don't want white walls, and I said, this is, this is going to work, you know. Great. And to be clear, these are just primer colors. We're not actually planning on a pink wall in this room. This <laughs> this is actually going to be a red wall. Okay. And red is one of the homeowner's favorite colors. Excellent. So it is, uh, he's going to have his, one of these walls is going to be red for sure. Perfect. Great. We can't wait to see the finished product. I know we won't get to see the finished product today. They're not going to let us in for the reveal once they show the homeowners. But we'll get to watch it in the fall when it airs on Fix It and Finish It uh, on WSFA. 12 News. Melissa? All right. Thanks, Bethany. Neat to see that being filmed right here in Montgomery. And as she mentioned, you can see the Fix It and Finish It through the power of Raycom Media.